come on in. Welcome to the immigration office. You're here for the three, um, sorry, the 1.30 appointment? Okay, great. You'll have a seat. Uh, I got a file started for you. to get you started um, with all of the basics for your new residency here in the United States. Um, is your family with you today? Okay, they're out waiting in the uh, waiting area. All right, that's fine. Um, we can go ahead and get started. information at first. So um, just to get your full name to start off with. Walter Georgia. Alright. And what uh, country are you immigrate from Germany okay. and how many um, how many of their how many are in your family five all together okay. <clears throat> Elizabeth is your wife all right. and three children is nine. Okay. Rudolph is six. And Katerina is two and a half. Okay, we'll just put two. <laughs> Alright. Okay. Well, our office provides. Um, the basics to make sure that you are, um, have a good experience in the country um, to see if you have any particular needs, help with employment, with finding schools for the children, um, housing, food, uh, all of the basics. So, do you, um, well, first of all, do you have uh, housing already lined up? No? All right. And do you know anybody here in New York? Just a distant uncle. Okay. But he doesn't have enough room. All right. Well, um, I'll give you some leads for housing, and we have a counselor that can help with that to find adequate space for your family. Mm -hmm. yeah. So, the, um, uh, all right. So, let's just go over some of the basic things that um, you might need some assistance with. Mm -hmm. First of all, let's start with employment. What was your uh, occupation in uh, Germany? Electrician? Right. And did you have a license or a certificate that you brought with you? You did? Okay. Well, that would be helpful um, if we could receive a copy of that. with any employers here? No, not yet. All right. Okay. And will your um, wife be seeking a job?
job also, or she'll be, she'll be staying at home. Okay. All right, well, I'm going to set up an appointment for you with Mr. Rogers. Is, um, let me check his schedule. Hold on a second. He does have an appointment uh, Monday at 2, 2 p.m. And that will be in the next office uh, down the hall. Okay. So make sure to uh, bring your documents you have, your electrician certificate, um, a summary of your past work experience would be helpful. Okay, so that should take care of the payment. Um, you know, for schools, um, since the school year has started already, we'll need to get you uh, your children registered, well, except for your, your baby, of course. <clears throat> um, oh, but of course we need housing first, so, because that will determine where your children will go to school. All right. Housing, um, we have um, apartment complexes right downtown, and um, but for your family of five, I was thinking a single family home more appealing. You'd have your own yard. And uh, there are some complexes out in um, just outside of the city. And they're pretty reasonable. Okay. Well, we do have a, a housing representative. Mm -hmm. That's Mrs. Uh, this is Rodriguez, and I'll give you all this information at the end, so don't worry about remembering everything. All right. So she, um, she's actually on vacation. Uh, she comes, she gets back on Tuesday. Um, but how about Wednesday morning? Okay. Nine o'clock. All right. So her, um, her office is right here in this building, too, just on the first floor. Um, now, the hotel that you're in now, are you able to, uh, do you have enough money to see you through until uh, you get set up in a house? You have some saving. Okay, well, that's good. We do have some housing vouchers we can set you up with if you need to until you get um, start getting a uh, paycheck. Mm -hmm. All right. So let's see, we've got the appointment, we've got the housing. Once again, um, if you end up in the housing complex that I mentioned, there are two really nice schools. Um, there's a Waldorf school, and, um, Washington Elementary. Yeah. So I think both your daughter and son would go to the elementary school. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, I will give you the uh, address and the name of the principal there. And what I would do is call and um, set up an initial 
visit where you can bring the children and she'll show you around the school and um, get your children involved. Mm -hmm. Okay. Do you have any questions so far? You know, it's a lot to go through. <laughs> um, yes, we do provide um, vouchers for medical care as well. I realize that since you're not employed yet, um, you know, you don't have the insurance that you will get. But we do, uh, if you if you'd like to go to the doctors, or if one of your children needs some medical care, uh, all you need to do is call me, and um, I will set you up with our secretary, and she can give you the names of the um, doctors that we have an arrangement with, so they'll. They will see you even though you don't have the insurance yet. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm glad you asked that. Okay. All right. So, um, a couple other things. Job situation taken care of, schools, medical, um, yeah, finances are okay. All right. So I'm, I think it's really helpful. I think we've got uh, most of your documents looking good. I'm just going to stamp these, and um, you also do need to get your fingerprints. So just put your thumb there on the ink pad, okay, and then just press right onto that paper there. is quite good. What about your children? And, okay. So we do have off, uh, free um, English classes as well. And it will definitely help when your kids get in school to have a little bit of uh, the English be a little bit stronger. Mm -hmm. So this is um, a list of all the English classes um, in the area, and they're just drop-in, you don't need to sign up. There's um, seven different levels, so you might want to try a few of them and see. Um, they will kind of give you a little bit of an assessment. Yeah. Okay. So I've gathered the information for you. Call because we really, um, we really do want you to be happy here and successful and thrive. Mm -hmm. Okay. Call me if you need anything. Okay. I wish you the best of luck. Bye bye.